So what's up y'all? Oh snap. I'm on camera. I'm on camera. I'm on camera. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay. How they do it? Cut! Hey guys, my name is Kaylin and welcome to my YouTube channel. What's poppin'? What's good? Fresh in the hood? I gotta, I gotta dance a little bit because I need to get myself a little bit hype. Kaylin, welcome to my YouTube channel. So, um, I, I'm kind of new to this and I'm standing up because I don't really have just, I'm standing up recording this video. So if I'm moving around a lot, just ignore it, whatever. Okay. So I actually wanted to come on here and do a get to know me video talk about myself a little bit since I am new here. A lot of people don't know me. Well, nobody knows me. I'm pretty much a nobody. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. But that's okay. That's okay. So I'm going to just start stating some stuff about me, get to know me, things people might be curious about, some questions people have had for me. So here we go. Okay, so one of the first first thing about me I am 23 years old and I was born January 5th 1995 um, I'm a Capricorn us Capricorns we lit we dope I mean who wouldn't want a Capricorn woman like let's be real even a Capricorn men like we the we the ish we are the ish like come on get with it us Capricorns <laughs> Fact number two, I live in St. Louis, Missouri. Um, no, I don't live in California. I don't live in Florida. I don't live in Texas, Tejas. I call it Tejas. I live in St. Louis, Missouri. Little 314, I will forever represent my city. This is where I was born and raised. I was actually raised in University City of St. Louis. I currently reside in Florissant, but that was initially where I was raised, UCD. Where you at? Where you at? Okay, thing number three about me. Uh, dang, I'm pretty whack. Give me a second. Okay, thing number three. I have a degree in criminal justice. I graduated a year ago from Southeast Missouri State University, class 2017. Um, so I initially started going to school for dance and I'll get to that in a second. I initially started going to school for dancing and um, that was my initial major. Then I realized I uh, kinda need a backup plan. And I find myself really, really interested in doing criminal justice. I was watching all the creepy investigation ID channels. I was watching all that creepy weird stuff. Like, it really intrigued me. So I got my degree in criminal justice and voila, I am a graduate with her bachelor's of science. Get at me, guys. That actually takes me into thing number four. I love to dance. That is my passion. That is my dream. I've been doing it since I was like, what, seven? I've been dancing since I was seven. I know a lot of people started at maybe three, but I started at seven and I, whatever. Mm. I can still twerk. I can twerk. I'm just playing. But no, I started dancing at seven, my very, very first dance class. Oh gosh. My mom took me to the YMCA and it was some little hip hop class and when I tell y'all I was getting it, I was getting it. I was up in there like, oh, hit that mono, hey, had my tongue out like, eh, eh, 
<clears throat> oh. And then my mom and then they was like, Caitlin, why are you dancing with your tongue hanging out your mouth? And I was like, I don't know, but I like dancing. So I kept dancing. So where I am now. Come here, Shadow. I guess thing number five can be that I have a dog. See how you see Say hi. He's a baby. He just likes to be held. Say hi, Shadow. Hey, guys. Um, I just wanted to be on the video. Lick me. Lick me. Oh, whoa. Oh, my gosh. Um, rub me now. Thanks. Thing number five. I work at AT&T. Everybody knows what AT&T is. I am an AT&T employee. I work for AT&T. I sell the cell phones. I sell these things. People be coming in asking me, I can't hear nothing on my phone. Why can't I hear nothing on my phone? I tell them, and this little button on right here, that button, I get their phone. They be thinking you're like a, a wizard. I be like, look fam, you got this do not disturb on your phone. That's why you can't hear nothing. They get their phone, they be like, oh my gosh, wow, oh my gosh, oh my god. Oh my god, wow, oh my god. That's literally what I do all day at work every day. Number six. Thing number six, I am 5'9", I am pretty tall, for a female, I don't care, um, but yeah, I'm 5'9", so I'm going to start trying to get into some modeling, a lot of people always tell me, you should model, you should model, and I'm always like, eh, I don't look the type, don't find myself attractive enough, but I'm going to try it, I'm going to try it, so we're going to see what happens, because I could do something with that, I mean, who knows, you never know. Mm. Number six or seven, I don't even remember now. Um, a lot of people are asking me why are you starting YouTube? I want to start YouTube to hopefully spread a message, share some positivity, and give people insight in my life and to really document my journey. I am 23, I feel like I'm undergoing a lot of changes, I feel like I'm going through a lot in life. I feel like I'm going on a journey, and I would like to be able to share that with people. I would love to be able to help other people and hopefully inspire others i think that would be really dope like for real like dope so yeah that's why i'm starting youtube so we're gonna see what happens with it number seven something a lot of people don't know about me at least until recently come on shadow chill out fam come here something that a lot of people don't know about me um, I can sing. No, I'm not a Mariah Carey. I'm not a Beyonce, but I do have a really nice voice. Um, never really thought about doing anything serious with it, but I can sing. Um, and I actually posted something on my you my Instagram, no, my Instagram recently, of me singing, and a lot of people were like, I didn't know you could sing. I can sing. I can sing and dance. So, yeah. Say hi. What the fuck? What the fuck? Thing number eight. I like working out. I actually, I love to work out, but do I eat healthy? Hell no. I'm drinking a whole quick trip slurpee right now. Like what? I eat like I weigh a thousand pounds. Like, you just don't understand. Let me explain this. 
I like to work out, but then I still go back and eat all this junk food. Like, how? Why? What's the point? Why? How? Like, I don't know. Number nine. I love going on adventures. So hopefully with this channel, I can travel some more and go out and travel and just embark on new journeys and show people and share that with a lot of people. I am all about adventure time. Like I don't care where, when, I'm about it and I love it. And it's so much fun just to be spontaneous and do stuff, like why not? Number 10, this was a question that I've gotten from a few people. Um, people that have seen me in person or just seen some of my photos, they ask about my tattoos. I have four tattoos in total. So they all have a meaning, they all have a symbolization to me personally. So I will explain them. So my very, very first tattoo, let me see, is this butterfly. And I got that when I was 21. I got it my senior year of college. Um, I was going through a lot of stuff at the time. A very close friend of mine, Danielle, I love you girl, what's up if you watch this video. My friend Danielle that I was with at the time, she was a very spontaneous person. So she would just be like, let's go do this, let's go do that. And I'd be like, okay. So this one day we were both out hanging out together and she was like, let's go get a tattoo. And I was like, a tattoo? I'm like a needle on my skin, ink in my body. All right, let's go do it, let's go. We went to the tattoo shop and I picked out my tattoo, got my tattoo, but of course I had to find one that meant something to me. So I got this butterfly. And I picked the butterfly because to me it symbolizes growth, change, transformation, metamorphosis, freedom, growth, um, being able to explore. And it also symbolizes beauty because butterflies are of course beautiful. So I got the butterfly. The second tattoo that I got was this one right here. That one. And it is just a simple three triangles. It stands for change, energy, and equilibrium. Um, I love the symbolization of this. And I actually got this from another YouTuber. Her name is Morgan Brown. And she goes by, um, hey, it's Morgan on YouTube. I really love her. And she's the one that inspired me with this tattoo. And to me, the change symbolizes me changing. I'm 23. I'm changing. I'm never going to stay the same. I'm never going to stay stagnant. The equilibrium, it stands for the balance in my life, finding peace, being centered with yourself. Of course, we all need to stay centered. And I can make another video on that because I have some tips and I have some tricks on how to stay centered. Another video. And then the, what is it? Change energy, equilibrium. The energy. You have to keep a good energy. It doesn't matter. If you're in a negative energy, do what you can to move out of that energy. So all three of those things are things that I hold dearly to my myself or things that I try to practice on a day-to-day -day basis and try to keep in my mind. So I love the meaning behind this tattoo and I wanted to get this tattoo. The third one that I have is this one. It stands for, well literally, it says love. It means exactly what it says. Love. Um, and then the fourth one, my very last one, is this one. I don't know if you can see it. Probably can't see it too well. That one is supposed to be the moon phases. Let me tell you, I got this tattoo. They messed it up. It was supposed to be the moon phases. It looked like smudged fingerprints on the back of my neck. I'm like, why would you do such a thing? But anyway, I got that one specifically because I'm pretty sure a lot of people can relate. Who feels a change in their energy on a full moon? Because I know for sure that I do. Anytime it's a full moon, it's like the energy is completely different. But me being a woman specifically, I wanted to get the moon phases on my spine because your spine is the base. Pretty much, it's the center of your chakras. And if you don't know what that is, Google it. Your chakras is pretty much um, energy flow, energy flow through your body. 
So I wanted to specifically get the moon phases right there on my spine because everything to me is just a big rotation of energy. So it it's a I can go a little bit deeper with that, but that's pretty much why I got that and why I got it where I got it. So those are all my tattoos. Um, so that's pretty much it. Those are just a few things about me that I wanted to talk about or just answer some questions. Um, if anybody has any suggestions as far as videos that they like to see me post, feel free to put that in the comments. I'm really trying to see what I can do with YouTube. Um, and just see where it goes honestly so please support please show some love show some likes subscribe and I will be back with another video love y'all